Hey guys, today I want to tell you about this really cool place in Colorado that I recently visited. It's called Bishop's Castle and it's located in Rye, Colorado, which is in the middle of the San Isabel National Forest. It's about an hour and a half south of Colorado Springs, an hour and a half drive south of Colorado Springs. So the castle was hand built by a man named Jim Bishop. And it's kind of like a funny story behind how it happened. He actually bought this land when he was only 15 for $450. And then he started to begin construction on what was supposed to be a family cottage. But some of the neighbors saw it and told him that it kind of looked like a castle and it just has kind of like evolved from there. It's a very like neat structure um, that's just kind of interesting to see. Um, the building, it's always open and there's always free admission and he's been building the castle for over 60 years so it's just there are some parts of it that are older than others and it's just a really neat place. There's a lot of hidden stairs and corridors and it's really fun. When, when I was there visiting there was a group of people who were playing hide and go seek and just like running around and having the best time. It was funny though because there's a lot of areas too that there's multiple towers that you can go up and stairs. So there's a lot of like very scary height places. So I was too scared to be running around at all, but these people were kind of doing their thing. But there's lots of towers and places that you can adventure and it can be scary. So if you are afraid of heights, I would suggest taking a friend who's brave to make you, you know, follow through and explore. Um, I'm actually terrified of heights and I'm going to be linking a video of me reading Goodnight Moon at the top of a tower at Bishop's Castle. I was like deep in horror but pushing through to get this video done so it was pretty funny. So throughout Bishop's Castle there was a lot of different like really impressive architectural things to see like a lot of different textures put together and very interesting like signs and this Jim Bishop guy seems very like off the grid and um, he has a lot of strong views about a lot of things so here's some footage of the castle and the different corridors and some of Jim Bishop's signs.